we visit a home that was built on ancient Roman ruins. Oh, wow. So you can imagine 2,000 years ago what it would, would have been. All here, the house is built on top of that. Yeah, this is Roman. And Ray Korsten, that was my dad. Cheers. Cheers. Salute. Cheers. Cheers. My name is Curtis Ryan Woodside. I'm a filmmaker and Egyptologist. After a year and a half of waiting to get back, last year I started to make my move to Italy permanent. I have visited Tuscany a couple of times before, but this time it's a little different. Now it's about settling in. So come with me on my adventures in Italy and beyond as I capture a video diary of my life and see what myself, Filippo, our family and friends get up to every week. Cheers. Cheers. Salute. Cheers. Salute. 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 <laughs> so this is the medieval wall of the city of Arezzo. Like the original Roman wall? This is original Roman. I think this is from around uh, 1200, 11, 1200. Okay. And um, we even have it inside the house, going yeah. into the kitchen, which is not really allowed, but Eva's grandparents did that. And then you can see that hole over there. Yes. Now, this is made into the wall, which this wall is about four meters wide. Okay. So it's really big. And during the Second World Impenetrable, War... Impenetrable, yeah. Exactly. In the Second World War, when there were bombs flying around, her, Eva's grandfather had two guys coming and they, I think they worked something like two months to make that hole yeah. because it's so thick and old. And when the bombs started flying, they would, the so family that's, would that's go the... inside and hide in there until the, the bombs stopped. So basically and, the bunker. Exactly. Yeah. And, and if you go up to the fortress, you can't see it from here yes. now. But the, yes, we drove the past. Medieval yeah. fortress up there. Yeah. You can see one part just right here next to the wall, which was bombed. And uh, so it's you sort know, of it, slumped down. Exactly. Yeah. So, you know, it was actually a, a really a problem. That's why they actually made this hole in the wall, so to speak. Not the hole in the wall in the trans sky. <laughs> but, you know, you know, so that's. I'll show a picture because people won't know what that is. Yes. Yeah. And then the house is from 1833. Okay. And uh, later on, we can make another video about this. Yes. The house is built on Roman uh, baths. Oh, Filippo was telling me. So, so the house is actually, it doesn't have a foundation. Okay. Um, it actually just, they just built it on the ruins of, of the, the Roman. Roman baths. Oh, wow. And um, the house is, there's been earthquakes and things like that, and it's still standing. So It's standing you know. better than most. But later on, we can go down to the, to the cellar, oh, and I'd we even have that. in the garage, we have a, an Etruscan. Okay. Now you're talking about more than 2,000 years yes. ago. About well, 2,400, 2,300 exactly. A well years, yeah. in the garage. Wow. From the Etruscans, the local TV came and put uh, waterproof cameras down and found uh, written things down Underneath. in the well. 
Oh wow! So you know this this if you start digging underneath this whole garden here, yeah, uh, you will find many things from two thousand years ago under underneath the garden. It's, it's okay. amazing. And then actually from the so where do I find a shovel? <laughs> <laughs> and then you have from the cellar. A tunnel going underneath the garden all the way up into the fortress oh, on top. Wow. Of course, now it's fallen down yes. uh, in this part here, but later on we'll go downstairs, downstairs and then you can video this and it's very interesting. Bon appetito, tutti. Bon appetito. <laughs> yes. Eva. 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 It's uh... <laughs> but it, it looks like salami a little bit. Okay, like, chocolate what, salami. Just tell him what, sì. what is in it because it's. Vabbè, prima lo, lo assaggio e poi ti dico cosa c'è. Che è meglio. First you try it and then she will tell you what's inside. Is, okay. Cookies made soft. Oh, you love yeah. it. Yeah, made uh, crum oh. in crumbles. A lot of uh, black Very. chocolate, okay. 75 this is, percent. This is really the Toscan. Ah, uh, it's receipt. wonderful. You never had it before. Eva and me, we are now together 22 years and uh, we met in Cagliari at the Teatro Lirico di Cagliari in Sardegna where I was musical director and we were doing together Don Giovanni and I remember the first musical rehearsal we had together with this soloist she came late for the rehearsal the prima donna came late so i immediately thought i immediately thought uh, i immediately thought well okay she's a stronza she's a uh, one of these prima donne uh, so but then uh, then i skipped the things that she missed that she had to sing but then when she came i said sing and she was a little bit like this and then i said to her just sing and then she started singing and i went I fell in love with her through her singing. Yeah. So, anyhow, I was married with two young girls, two young daughters, five and six years old. Mm. So, I fell in love with her. No, 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 no details. No details. But then, um, at the dress rehearsal of Don Giovanni, my dressing room was next to hers. I heard a knock. And you were conducting. I was conducting. Yes. And I was in love with her, but I didn't say a word. And I didn't know her, what she thought. And then she knocked on the door and she came in with her beautiful dress, Donna Anna, classical dress for the opera, and looked at me and said, Maestro... Five minutes before the... Before the dress rehearsal dress start. Rehearsal. And she said to me, Maestro, I'm in love with you. <laughs> and I... Detto, I just... Sono innamorata di te, poi te lo devo dire. Poi tu fai quello che vuoi, ma io ti devo dire questa cosa. Oh! And she told me my shoulders just went like that because I was in love with her, but I didn't say anything because you know I was married and I didn't want to have problems and all that. Anyhow, to make a 22 years of story short, um, then um, we met again. She, the, we finished the opera season and then she went back to Arezzo where we are now. And it was nothing. And there was nothing. Nothing happened nothing with happened. us. We kissed a little bit on the beach and that, but nothing happened really. <laughs> and then. Uh, she came, I went back to conduct in the summer, I, I can't remember what I conducted, uh, Carmen or something in the summer. And she came, and she came to, the, um, to visit me and then we started having this love affair, but then I told my wife about this and then it was a casino and then in the end I flew to South Africa and I went to my mother and I told her the story and I'm in love with this other girl. My mother said to me one very wise thing, she said, my dear boy, take time. Then we didn't hear on the telephone, no SMS, nothing for one year. I completely switched off from her. Then we were back in Sardinia, Cagliari, Barbier di Sevilla, and then the whole thing exploded, and that was the beginning of 22 wonderful years together. Okay. Wow. And I'm still friends with my ex-wife, and my daughters are wonderful, and we're all friends, and everything is great. So, happy, happy ending. Happy ending. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, okay. Okay.
sì. Sai che una volta c'era là sotto sì, la sì, parte... Sì, sì. This door here is from the time of this house was built, probably. 18... 1833. 18... So this key, if you look, it goes in there the wrong way. Yeah. <laughs> First you have to get it in. Then, instead of opening it like that, you go the opposite way. You go that way. Okay. So, Amelia wants to go in very quickly. Amelia wants to go inside. Let's go see. Yeah, let So. Oh, wow. These. These things. Tutto here. questo è romano. It's questo è un Roman. tipo, un tipo yeah. di costruzione. From the. From the. Uh, uh, Primo secolo the, dopo Cristo. Yes, uh, 100, 100 after Christ. 100, 100 AD. One after Christ, yeah. Eight. First century after, after Christ. Christ. Yes. yes, so, But, for instance, these places, Eva, the, here were the, the water uh, terme, the, yeah. the, 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 people, bus. the bus where the people came. Because here, uh, it was, um, qui c'era una sorgente di acqua. There was a, a thermal, uh, thermal, thermal water, water here. here. Yes. And the so spring. This the spring. was, this yeah. was uh, where they heated the water as well. And no? they are three, three, tre bocchettoni, yeah. si chiamavano Three bocchette holes, yeah. da cui usciva yeah. l'acqua, tepidarium, frigidarium e calidarium, okay. da cui usciva acqua calda, molto calda. And you see the drain as well. Sì, questo è medioevale. Here as well. Questo è un tunnel medioevale. Medieval. So, After this is all, this is all. This is very interesting because this is the old kind of, of, uh, that's what the, no, yeah. that's what the Alfe Art uh, cement, Sumar. Old way of making cement, fond, yes. Fond, fond of the Romans. Yeah. Which was like the limestone, yeah. Exactly. Si chiama Pozzolana perché è una parte di sasso, mm -hmm. è una parte di, um, wie heißt dieser Stein? Questo, questa Granin. pietra oh, molto, yeah. no, no. È una pietra porosa, lo vedi che, che sì. come gesso. Va bene, è uguale. Oh, yeah, like, like like sì, so, and, and this, this, all here, the house is built on top of that. Yeah. Without yeah. foundation. So, this is the Ro is this a Roman arch? No, this no. is new arch. This new arch. is medieval. Okay. Okay. But, but, this, yes. but, yes. so, but this is, this is Romano. And, and you can see here they are only... So this is the Romano part. Yeah. Yeah. And that's Everything the medieval here, part. And this is number one, the hot water, hot number water. two, the medium, medium hot, and this one was the cold. Cold water. And here, uh, here were uh, uh, um, vasche. Pools. 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 Like the jacuzzi. Si. <laughs> Se, uh, when people, when man does, um, yes. back to it, it's in the basket, what do you get So And here is a tunnel, yes, which yes. used to go yeah. all the way to the fortress. So this goes all the way to the fortress that was bombed in World War II. Exactly. Same way. Under the ground. It was built, but, but somewhere along the way it's already cascaded, it's, it's collapsed. already collapsed already. Okay. But this it's, used to be a way that they could actually escape somehow if there were no, problems. Qui yeah. c'è una storia di questo. The, there's a history of this. Uh, perché sono stati dei, degli archeologi, una, yes. tipo una trentina, quarantana anni fa, ero piccola ancora. Mm -hmm. E sono passati di qui e il mio yeah. babbo gli diede il permesso di entrare qui e hanno aperto per yeah. una parte perché era chiuso. Gave, uh, la devono cementare. Sì, io dovrei mettere delle luci qui perché è molto interessante. Yeah. Eh, entrando più sotto qui, so gli archi one. non sono archi ma sono fatti like, like così. E questa era it. una costruzione tipica degli etruschi. Etruscan, yeah. so this could very well have been made by the Etruscans. Eh, okay. No, 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 you can't see because no, no, it's can't so, see a lot. It's it's much so, further. This is by the deck. But further on they have mm. these kind of things which are okay. Etruscan. Etruscan, 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 Etruscan like tombs. Yes. Well, building this, sì. they don't really know why, no? Okay. 
Ma la, la cosa interessante della There's casa. There's a lot of history in your house. Yeah. These okay. few of the foundation <laughs> and this. Andiamo di là e c'è okay. lo stesso trave nel garage. Sì. E questo è incredibile perché una so. mia amica architetto giapponese yeah. che ho conosciuto, Nila Yoko, sì. è venuta qui e mi ha detto se c'è terremoto tanto forte questa casa non cade. Will be okay. Very strong house. Perché Yeah, it's also flexible. Quite flexible. So this here in the summer, when this is when it's 40 degrees outside, yeah. it's in here. It's, yes, like this. It's like, like this. this. The nice temperature is, is. So if you really the want, you bring a chair. You yeah. open a bottle of wine and you sit here and read the book. <laughs> okay, I'm coming. We're coming here in August. <laughs> <laughs> what is down here? So down here is a, a well of the Atrus Etruscans. Yeah. You can see down there. My goodness. It, it doesn't work so well anymore. Yeah. But they came here with a camera of the local television and, and discovered some Etruscan writings. All the way there. down in the well. Yes. Wow. So you can imagine 2000 years ago what it would, would have been. What would have been down, down there? Down there. Uh, wow. Filippo. Philly, come see this. Ah, this is beautiful, yes. This is beautiful. Ah, ah. The Etruscan. But there was a light here. Yes, there was a light here. Ah, okay. This is the Cisterna Etrusca. All in the garden. This is so Roman Eva's garden. grandmother found all of these pieces. She found this in the garden, no, under the earth. So a Roman lion from straight from the garden. <laughs> that would be, I don't know, from when, a thousand years ago. Yeah, Roman more. would be two, about two thousand years. See? <laughs> Gerard, you were talking to us earlier and you mentioned your dad's name and I actually recognize that your dad is a very famous opera singer from South Africa. Can you tell everyone who yes, he is? Yes, uh, well, I showed you this book earlier, which I have here. Yes. In Italy, where we are. So, Gay Korsten mm -hmm. was very famous in South Africa. As soon as you said the name, I yes. instantly... He was known yeah. for opera, but also light music, making movies, television mm -hmm. programs. Yes. And this was... A very big personality in South Africa. Huge personality in the, in, from the 60s, 70s, 80s until the 90s. He passed away in 1999. Mm -hmm. And this book was made of my dad uh, of, about his life. More a photo profile than anything else yeah. with photos of him there in Europe in the 1960s when he came to study for a year in Europe and then some photos of, of different uh, programs, different operas that he did. Yeah. Some of his, uh, one of his first records he made. Uh, it's just very interesting yeah. to see the history of my dad. Uh, they, he won this uh, Medium Award in Cannes in France for selling so many millions of records. Yeah. And yeah, that, that was my dad. Amazing. And uh, I sort of went on, he, his dream was actually to be a conductor, but he never, you ended up. <laughs> he never actually managed to do that or study music, but I turned out to be a conductor. Exactly. Living in Italy and uh, yeah, loving every moment of it. Well, this whole, the whole story comes around. So yep. There you go. I would like to give a big thank you to my patrons for not only supporting my Egyptology work, but my filmmaking in general. And thank you to all of you for watching and supporting my videos.